Hello everyone. Welcome to SRBPS online classes. This is your science teacher Nisha Sharma going to teach you for class 3. Our today's topic is types of feathers and how do birds fly. Okay? So today we are going to learn two topics types of feathers and how do birds fly so first of all we'll start with the first topic which is types of feathers mainly there are three types of feathers flight feathers body feathers and down feathers what are these F flight feathers body feathers and down feathers clear and these all feathers have different functions see down feathers down feathers are soft short and fluffy and these lie next to the bird's skin we can say these are uh, present on the belly part of the bird clear and these help to keep bird's body warm these feathers provide warmth to the body of a bird clear next is body feathers body feathers covers the whole body body feather covers the whole body of a bird and it gives shape to bird's body clear it gives shape to bird's body the next one is flight feathers flight feathers are on wings and tail and these help to fly and to change direction while flying clear these help to fly and to change direction while flying this is our types of feathers now the next topic is how does a bird fly or what helps a bird to fly clear so what are the features in the bird's body which help it to fly which helps it to fly clear so our features are first of all birds have wings to fly they have wings to fly and these wings have feathers these wings have feathers and strong muscles attached to them okay these wings are attached to strong muscles of the bird clear and because of the strong arms and chest muscles a bird can flap its wings for a longer time and it can fly clear and the second one is the body of a bird is light very light which help it to fly clear the bodies of birds are very light which helps help them to fly easily why the body is light it is light because bones of the birds are thin light and hollow the bones are thin light and hollow hollow means which are empty from inside have you ever seen a straw straw from which you are drinking you are sucking juices okay like that only the bones are there which are present in the body of bird okay now next is the shape of bird's body the shape of bird's body is like an aeroplane you can compare the bird's body with an aeroplane as you can see in the picture see like an aeroplane only the bird's body is narrow in the front it is narrow in the front because it can cut the air it can go through the air with the help of this narrow part and they have broad body in the middle okay and the at the end again it becomes narrow clear with the help of this feature or this shape it can fly easily i think it is clear to you okay and next is their tail which is very important in flying see with the help of tail only a bird can change its direction in order to turn while flying a bird uses its tail clear and they are using some movements for flying see 
there are two kinds of movement of wings which help it to fly now like upward movement of wings and downward movement of wings okay the bird flap its wings in upward and downward directions which causes it to move in a forward direction okay when it flaps its uh, wings upside and downside upward and downward then only it can fly forward clear and while landing on the land or while uh, coming down to the land or to stop the bird spreads out its wings and stretches its feet as you can see in the picture it has just stretch it its feet to the forward side okay to the front side and then it is trying to stop itself and this position creates a drag which helps it to stop clear this is how a bird fly how a bird fly and with the help of which features they are flying the features are wings hollow bones lightweight body and aeroplane shaped body clear so these only features help a bird to fly in the sky clear i think this topic is clear to you so and you got understand you got all the concepts so thank you for watching the video bye bye everyone